What is the demon doing, man? I'm pretty sure this guy's got brain worms. Dude, if I get too close to this thing, it's going to be bad news. Roll slip gator. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no. your friendly neighborhood slip gator here hanging out today doing stuff and things playing some arc survival evolved on the pooping evolved aberration server hope you guys are having a good day i am having a great day yeah thanks so much for coming to hang out with me today guys make sure if you like the video that you see please don't forget show your support smash the thumbs up button and if you're new and you haven't already don't forget to subscribe as well look at it and all of its amazing glory our unbelievable and super powerful, amazing Reaper, who we are going to call, who we are going to call the Blue Oyster. The Blue Oyster. And I feel like we need to start a cult. We need to start a cult. What will we name our cult? I think we should name it the Blue Oyster Cult. And then everybody... We'll be unbelievable and amazing with our blue oyster cult and our unbelievable reaper. And then we'll have our, our cult gather. They'll gather around the reaper. And I'll tell them, don't fear the reaper. Don't fear the reaper. It's fine, everybody. He's super fine. Blue oyster's no big deal at all. So our very first unbelievable and amazing reaper is here. Does he jump? Oh, he's got mad hops. Dude, this guy's got the mad hops. What's the, what's the world's worst turning radius like? He actually turns pretty good. And then run speed. Okay, not the best, not the best ever. Also, I do believe I'm gonna need to get some food on this guy. Uh, wait, food, 59, Hey, he's doing okay. We've already got eight levels. Let's go ahead and break down the statistics. We didn't take a look at it last time. 83, 72 HPs. He's not that super high level, only level 85. 500 weight, 350 melee damage. Let's pump a point of HPs. We get about a thousand. 1100 per point. Let's go ahead and get that up and let's go ahead and pump the rest of these points Well, I think one point at least Oh, one percent movement speed ouch All right 525 for that guy there. So I'm not really sure how this guy works I'm not really sure all the things that we can do. What's this guy? What's this doll's got like a second house deal over here? Ah, yeah, oh we're stuck. Okay. Can we get our Reaper out? Let's go! Does he take fall damage? Oh, I don't think it does. Interesting. Oh, what's this? Do you see I get a cursor sometimes? Is it only when I'm... Okay, it's when I'm not looking at a friendly deal. Okay. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Let's have a look at the statisticals here. Or the, the, uh, the stuff things that we can do. Left click. Oh, his mouth is really red. He's got a real red mouth, man. He's got a lot of saliva, too. Look at that. Dude. All right. Uh, uh, that was left click, right click. He's throwing the acid deal. All right. So is that like aim head with this thing? And it kind of goes in a direction. But kind of, kind of not. Oh, it looks like some of them. Is it like a random chance? Yeah. They go kind of, kind of up in that deal. A uh, little C. Oh, the tail swipe, baby. Dude, let's see that again. Yeah! And then left shift, left control. Oh! Left control does the unbelievable and amazing taunt. Blah, 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 blah. You want to get a... Get a blah, blah, blah. It's like a shower. Blah. Can I get even closer? <laughs> blah, 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 Dude, it's so, it's so moist. Oh, God, it's the moistest of all the things. All right, let's go ahead and try him out here. Let's see what we can do against something like, uh, what are these guys? Go! Fire! Fire! Is that nine damage? <laughs> Jesus, what a... <laughs> well, but it, it seems like it might be doing like a dot, but it's only doing nine damage. I'm just gonna keep throwing them out there. Yeah, let's do this. All right, nine damage, let's see the bite. 300 damage, tail swipe. Two on less, less for the tail swipe, and it doesn't seem to do a knockback or anything like that. Oh, you want to run? Get out of here! You're stupid and dumb. Let's go. How's my stamina looking right now? Does this attack take stamina? Oh yeah, it looks like it sure does. 
Oh, they're all coming out. You want to go? Take it to the limit. We got to we gotta level up. Let's go ahead and just see here. If we just pump like one point into... Oh, we got three. There we go. Are we doing 10 damage now? <laughs> no, still nine. <laughs> oh, 427 on the attack. Nice. Not bad. Interesting. And we got some meat up in this piece. Are you, now, I can't remember. I don't know if he eats meat. Oh, oh, oh. It's going down like a sun. I don't think it does eat meat. I can't remember. 86, 85. Oh, it's not eating meat. Now, is this the guy we have to feed? I can't remember. Does it feed pheromones to it or something like that? I'm not exactly sure. I'm pretty happy with him, though. We got to figure out what it is. Because I don't think he's eating any of this meat right here. We got to figure out what... Make sure that we know what he's going to be eating because uh, he's going to run out of food pretty quick here. I'm not sure if he has any other special ability powers either. I will say this. This guy is slow AF. Like, beyond slow. Ugh. Uh, okay. Uh, so I'm going to check out some stuff. Things. You can also bury and unbury this guy. So you can see like so. We can click in here, hit bury. And he'll go ahead and burrow down under the ground like so. So he's like easy storage. You know what I mean? Should have named him Tupperware. Oh, my God. And we're back. Almost at our base. That took a long time. I, forget, I always forget sometimes how hard it is for dinos to just follow you and walk. Um, so, we're back at base, though. We made it. I got him a little bit of XP on the way over. And then I was thinking, you know, I really got to level this guy up. So, uh, see, what? Why? Just that one little scorpion, huh? Where you at, man? Where you at, homie? It's over for you. Now, let's go ahead and try. Can we get him in the base? Is it possible? Come here. Come here. Come here. Let's open. Open the door. And get in here, man. Greg, Bog, Bonky. We got all sorts of stuff and things going on. Meet Blue Oyster, guys. You guys, listen up. Hold on, let me shut the door. You guys, listen up, man. Okay, we're starting a cult. We're start. We're starting a cult. All right. Yeah, dude, we're starting a cult. What's over in here? You guys, we're starting a cult, guys. Okay. It's gonna be called the Blue Oyster Cult. That's the reaper. We're going to worship that reaper. But don't have to fear it, okay? All right. Close this. Do it. He's done it. So I think that what we're going to do is go ahead and try to get some hot level action up on this guy. Uh, let me go ahead and check statisticals. On the way over, we got Al level. Um, he's still healing. He just eats meat, by the way. Uh, I don't know why it was. It looked like he wasn't eating it, but it's perfectly fine. He was just eating some hot meat action. Uh, I want to go ahead and get him level up a little bit. So I might take him out. One day. Out. Into the... What am I stuck on? Oh, dude. I'm going to take him out into the river and just give him some hot levels, I think, is what we're going to do. It's super dark right now. Ugh, there. A little bit better. Um, so, yeah. I think I'm going to take him out and get him some hot levels. I just want to see how well we can do this guy. I don't want to spend a ton of time on, time on him just because he is only an 85. But I definitely think that we need to get maybe, you know, like 105% movement speed, um, some levels, um, just for HP, stuff and things like that. So we're just going to head down the river here and destroy everything. Death and destruction. Mayhem incoming. Yeah! Look what I found. You trying to talk about some hot XP action? Female Alpha Carca Carcanos, only level 10. So, it ain't going to be that big of a deal, but I've already got 14,000, uh, nay, 15,000 HPs, 1,000 melee damage, that's 105% movement speed, and a little bit more melee damage up in this piece, like so. Let's go over and see if we can't do this. It's only level 10. I'm not that afraid of it, I hope. I don't know how amazing alpha carks are, but I'm going to check it out. Let's get, the, let's get this guy on there. Slow it down a little bit. Are you slow? Are you feeling slow? Are you feeling stupid and dumb? Let's go! Oh, no. Oh, this could be hard. Oh, no. Wow. Wow. Wow, this thing's got a lot of HPs. Oh, my God, dude. It has a lot of HPs. Oh, my God, dude. It has a huge amount. Okay, it's got a little bit of blue on the knuckles. A little poison deal. A little tail swipe guy. Yeah, get back there. Yeah, you better run. Don't know what's good for you? Blue Oyster! Annihilate! Destroy! Do work! Yeah! 
get some. Dude, we gonna get any super amazing deals from this deal? Look at his little dead body. Access the inventory. Oh, Alpha Carcanus Claw. I had no idea that was an option. Well, I mean, that's cool. This trophy provides you, uh, proves you worthy as a hunter. What are you doing over here, buddy? What are you doing there, guy? Okay, was he drinking water, I think? How many levels did he get off that? Five, that's not bad, man. That's not bad at all. I will say straight away, obviously, any dino that doesn't have a saddle takes way more damage. Um, and that is true for this guy as well. And there's no, there isn't like a Reaper saddle, is there? I mean, I don't, I don't think that there is, but. Reap? Uh, no. So, I didn't think so. Uh, maybe in a modded game, there'd be a Reaper saddle, but not here. So, they take a lot of damage. So you got to be really, really careful about that. Uh, where do we want to put our, if we, if we're going to take a lot of damage, 105%. He actually seems slow, but I will tell you that he, he's not that slow. It's not that bad. He kind of walked, you know what I mean? You're moving along. It ain't, it ain't terrible. I'd like to get him up to 110, maybe 20,000 HPs. Um, cause he's probably gonna need that. You saw we went from what, 15 to 11 fighting that and it was only a level 10. Um, let's just go ahead like this, like this, and like this, and like that. There you go. There's 20,000 HPs right there. Alright. I'm gonna level him up some more, peeps. This guy is awesome! Yeah! And we are back. I have been leveling up for quite a while, and I am quite happy, in fact, with my unbelievable... Is that a horse? Whoa, I didn't even know they were here. I don't think I've ever seen one in Aberration before. Ugh. Ugh. Tell me about your stuff and things. Teach me about what level horse of you are. Mm, 25. I feel like you deserve to die. I feel like it's over for you. What's on the menu for dinner? Horse meat. Mmm, d -rish. So, I've been loving this guy up for a while. Like I said, I'm very happy with the statisticals. A couple of things that are pretty cool. You know how spinals run away? Not anymore, man. When they get hit by that stuff, it slows them down super fast. Well, plus he does enough damage. He just, like, two hits them. But it does slow, slow anything down. It's like a Paraceratherium. Anything that runs like that, it's kind of nice. You just squirt them with your butt squirt, and then they just can't run. It's super great. And he's doing about as much damage as Dwayne. So it isn't bad. Dwayne, our, uh, our rock drake. So it ain't bad at all. It ain't bad at all. So I like this guy quite a bit. I do feel like... I think it's because he's low level. I think if he was higher level, it would be kind of baller. I feel like Dwayne outclasses him. Like, obviously, movement speed's way better. Uh, takes less damage. Not quite as much HPs. Does a little bit more damage. But it is still cool. To have 700, that's it? Okay. Uh, he was doing like around a thousand to some other stuff, I think. But it is still pretty unbelievable and amazing. And obviously, I mean, you have the blah, 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 shower. So you can always get, you know, cleaned up after a hard day's doing stuff and things. So I feel like it's time now. We're going to park this guy back at base. We have him here. Oh, hey, no bullying. I'm the only bully around here, bully. I love you guy. 115, 115. So we'll stick this guy back at the base. I don't know if we'll ever use it for breeding or anything like that. But um, we absolutely need to make sure that everybody is worshiping Blue Oyster. Let's bury it. Get down in there, man. Dude, I think it's super cool that you can bury them. And the Basilisks as well. So uh, a couple episodes ago, we were thinking about doing some Basilisk taming. I haven't really got into that yet. And I'm not sure exactly how it all works. Um, if I'm not mistaken, and I very well could be quite mistaken, in fact. I think you've got to use... Get up there. Oh, crap. I think you've got to use uh, bass, oh, no, no. rock drake eggs, right? Is that right? Get up there. He's done it. <gasps> How the crap are you at my base? No way, dude. What? Who are you? What are you doing here? How did you spawn in the base? Dude, get out. Get out. If I punch him, he's going to go eight all over everything. Is he high level too? Oh, of course. 105. So I won't be able to kill him like super, super quick. Oh my god, I can't! I can't risk it! If he does a tail swipe, we'll take out all my hard work! I guess we'll just have to be friends with you then, I guess. Wild female aberrant stegosaurus level 105. Just gonna be chilling out in our base being a ha being our friend. Oh, you here, get out! Oh, sorry. Here, you know, maybe I'll let you set you free. Here, set you free, man! There's freedom, go for it! Go, be free! Yeah, see it? You're looking back at it! And we're back. A certain stego that was part of the the cult has disappeared. 
I don't know where it's gone. All right, so over here, I have gathered up some stuff and things right here. Uh, level 60 rock drake, level 20 rock drake, and level 60 rock drake eggs. And is that, do we have enough stuff and things? Okay, so we're going to be good. Uh, if we take a look at the spoilage timer stuff and things, we're going to be fine having them in our inventory like so. And that's what we're going to need if we want to team a basilisk. Um, now, where the basilisks are around here, I'm not really sure. I haven't seen a whole bunch right in this area. I know back towards where our original community base was, there were a bunch. But I don't know about around here. I kind of would like to get one that's a little bit closer. Uh, can we? Would you please? Is it okay if we... Yeah, I don't know if there are any in this area here. Like I said, back towards the community center, I definitely know that we have more. Um, can I? Okay. Uh, it's not exactly what was trying to happen. I was trying to go upwards. I'm trying to go up on top of this deal right here. Climb up on this deal, guy. Now climb over, climb over in this, climb in this deal. Now climb up over in this deal, guy. Now climb up over here, climb like this. Now come up over here like so. Dude, we are up here like you never saw. Oops. Ooh, no! Oh, crap, I missed. Ah! These are so easy to control. <laughs> so, I'm going to look around for... <laughs> God. I'm going to look around for a basilisk. Right here, dude. This is the one. This is it. Let's go. Yeah! All right. This should allow me, I think, if I follow... That guy ends right there. I can't remember... No, not this way. I think if I follow it this way... I think this will take me back to the beginning. We'll look for a basket. I don't. I really don't want to go too far from my base. I don't want to have to walk it all the way back. Um, but yeah, we'll have a look around. We'll go ahead and find one. What is that glowing deal down there? <gasps> Mystical, magical uh, bugs, I do believe. We'll have a look around here. It's the Paraceratherium Knievel up here doing stuff and things, man. And we'll be our bees once we find the basilisk beeps. And we are back at the beginnings is of the map. I'm starting to fly around. I just like took a fly around for like 40 minutes or half an hour, actually. Uh, yeah, probably a half an hour. Just kind of like trying to figure out where everything was. Um, I still find this map to be really confusing. But at the same time, it's just really cool to fly around in. It's, it's so much bigger than you think it is. It's freaking huge, man. Anyway, so I remember when we first started doing stuff and things here on Aberration... There were, I went exploring around, and I remember finding a bunch of basilisks over in this area right here. Can I see that yet? Yeah, let's go, baby. Right up over this area, I'm pretty sure. Oh, look, somebody's got a little deal over here. DP. Uh, that sounds naughty. An LL. Must be Lapis Lori. Um, so I remember seeing some basilisks around this area here. I think this is where I'm going to start my search. I was searching kind of like all around when I was flying around. But I didn't really see anything. Now, the cool thing is with the Basiliscas is that they should not attack me while I'm on the Drake. So this means that this is good. Not being attacked by Basiliscas is the best way to encounter a Basilisk. I can't believe I'm not finding any. <laughs> I haven't seen any at all. Um, and I can't remember. I was looking a little bit. I can't remember if they, they're they like an only at night deal or not. I don't know if they only come out at night or something like that. Not exactly sure, but the majority, of course, of what I've been flying around has been during the air quotes daytime here. So, yeah, uh, I found so many over here when I first was on the server. Maybe everybody's teamed them all up everywhere. I'm not exactly sure. But anyway, this is such a great area over here. It's a really beautiful spot. Oh, man, there's a whole deal going on right there, man. These guys are in a whole battle fight. So it's super cool just to, like, explore around and see what's going on, especially in the daytime when it's, like, super pretty and beautiful around here. Um, I'm going to continue to look around. Uh, and uh, when we meet again, when we next meet, ladies and gentle peeps, I will. I will have found a basilisk. And we're back. Level 90 female basilisk. And, yeah, we're, right, we're kind of on the edge. See on the map right there, like, from where I am, kind of over to the east... That's where one of the like spawn locations are for these guys. So uh, what we got to do now is we have to start dropping eggs. So let's go ahead uh, into our inventory like so. And let us go ahead and drop an egg on the ground right there. Then, oh, it's already coming. It's already doing this deal. Oh, it's mad at me. Ooh, ah. So we have to get it to kind of attack the egg. Well, let me see here. I kind of want to drop more than one. So it needs to be like un-aggro. Ooh. If I come over this way, maybe. Come over here, man. Come over here, man. Are you going to eat that deal? Doesn't want that deal. Doesn't like my deal. 
just gonna kind of keep trying to run Come over here homie well oh, it doesn't want to it's not even it's not even a little bit upset where did it go let me pop over here oh no 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 oh ooh, ooh. Drop one right there. Let me see if I can get his attention. Ah! Oh, it's coming. It's coming this way. I gotta get it. I gotta. It's gotta aggro on me. Oh, it's killing this bulb dog deal. Hold on, hold on. Drop another one right there. Oh, it's killing that bulb dog. Uh, it's having a really hard time killing the bulb dog. Look at it go, man. What a stupid dumb. Okay. What is it even doing, man? I'm pretty sure this guy's got brain worms. Dude, if I get too close to this thing, it's going to be bad news. Rolled Slip Gator. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no! Uh, Dwayne, Dwayne, yeah! We did it! Yeah, baby! Jake the Snake, let's go. Let's do it up, man. Dude, we are so far from home, Jake. We're so far from home. Tell me about your ways. Teach me about your snakeity. Snakeosity? Snakeitude. Oh, he's so cute. I love how he turns his head all sideways. He's a snake. He's a snake. Uh, all right. All right. How does this even work? It's like the world's bestest Titan bow of all time. T, whistle passive. How the crap are we going to get this guy home? Number one, where is home? Okay, I have an idea of uh, kind of sort of a where we can go here. It's going to be a little bit of a trip. He's got a little fork deal, a little trident deal in his tail area place. Huh? Okay, what if I can just nuzzle down inside of here? Ah, uh, yeah. Go for a little ride on the, on the back of your basilisk. Uh, can you stand up there, big guy? Okay, okay, stuff is happening. And, and we're stuck. All right, so he's unbelievable and amazing. One of the things that I didn't kind of think of ahead of time is that we're gonna need a basilisk saddle right here. Cementy paste fiber, green gems, and hide metal ingots. Uh, 425, I think I have enough. We should have enough of all that stuff back at the base to get that done. Level 134, look how cute he is. All right, statisticals, let's check him out, baby. That's not bad. 2,000 stamina, 6,000 health, 3,000. Holy crap, dude. Dude, this guy's gonna be amazing. His weight is astronomical. Melee damage, 377. Doll Danta was talking about making a, air quotes, weight basilisk, and I absolutely see why now. These guys' natural weight is absolutely redonkulous. So, we got to take this guy. Oh, wait. Where did our other... Wait, where did, did we have other eggs? Where did our other eggs go? There were other eggs around here. Uh, Stay there. You stay there, homie. Okay, let's go ahead and grab these guys up. They stay... They keep for a huge amount of time. So, make sure we just get those guys. We don't want to drop them down. And now... We begin the amazing process of trying to get this guy back to our base. Let's go, Jake. Come on, man. Ah, uh, we've done it. He's done it. Passless saddle. Nailed it. It's cave stop. Craft up one of these bad home braids for me like so. Oh, yeah, baby. That's what's up. Actually, we've got to take a second here, too, and squirt away. Where are my trophy deals? Uh, that guy inside of there. And let's go ahead and put our Drake eggs away inside of here like a so. All right, buddy. Let's go ahead and check this bad boy out right here. Come over here, homie. Just walk right off the edge. Yeah! Yeah! Park it. All right. So, we'll go ahead over to this guy now. He did get attacked a little bit on the way home. Hit points are doing super great. I feel like I want to pump one point into HP just to see what that's going to do for us. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Was that like... Was that 1,400? And then wait. We've got 3,080. So it's about 140 weight per point, which is not bad at all. We get on top of this guy like so. Dude, this guy's unbelievable. Dude, I'm so into my snake. Oh, wait. He's a little bit... Uh, Do I got something weird going on here? Okay. Is it just me or is it really hard to see when you're on this guy? Oh, no. They're really hard. To oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Does he climb like a sun? Wait, wait. Oh, I think he probably can go over two high walls or something. Wait, is he climbing up this? Let's just open this bad boy up. We'll see what's up. Let's get out of here. Okay, it's a little hard. It's a little weird. See how the camera's kind of like back away? So it feels a little bit odd. You get this guy closed up here so no bad hombres get into our base. All right, let's get back on this guy. Let me see here. Yeah, the camera feels really weird. Left click. Hot attack action. 
There he goes. You know, a little bit of a deal. And this guy's got a salvation deal going on too. Okay. Right click. Oh yeah, the poison deal. C? Oh, what was C? Just like a roar? Just a little quiet shower of a roar. X, nothing. Left shift, nothing. Left control. He burrows somehow. I'm not sure exactly how it works. Uh, wait, there's a, uh, uh, this guy, this guy. I'm, I, I'm positive that this guy burrows. Is it while you're running you have to do something? No. Okay. That's just his other deal. I know you can burrow this guy somehow. Is it like the other shift? No. All right, I'll have to check it out. I have to take a look at the controls there. Oh, does he jump? Oh, space bar! That's how you do it, man! And then... Look at this, man. Now, unfortunately, if I, if I understand correctly... Dude, you can just go underground. How long can you do this for? Until your stamina runs out? And it just uses stamina while you are not even moving. Surprise! Oh, my God. Barry is on cooldown. Can we see it on the screen? It doesn't look like we we're able to see a cooldown. Uh, which is dumb. Uh, but we can just wait for it, I guess. Dude, this guy's so crazy. Now, I want to know about the climbing. He kind of felt like he was a climber, boy. So, okay, that's super weird. Does he have, like, a right-click deal? No, not like a not like a rock drake or anything like that. You would think that the basilisk could climb. Okay, we are in the rock. Oh, I'm hurt. I'm super hurt. Why? I'm not sure. Let me back, let me back out of here. We're backing out. Was it from being underground? Is that what kicked my arse? Oh, dude, this guy is super cool, but he's super weird. Why am I so hurt, man? Uh, all right, let's eat a little bit of deals. That'll help with a little bit of regain of the HPs. Let's try this again. Oh, yeah, there's an O2 stat. I didn't even notice that, man. I think that's how we got... I think that's how we did it. The O2 stat. Now, like I was saying, you can't climb under walls, which is unfortunate. Can we... Can you climb over this wall, deal guy? Are you good enough for that? Really? That is so strange, man. This guy is really, really weird to control. I feel like... Okay, we're in. Okay. Oh, no. Come back up. We're, whoa, whoa. We're underground. What is happening? Okay, stop. Slow, 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 slow down. Now, can you turn a corner there, big guy? Dude, the basilisk is super weird to control. I feel like with a lot of these dinos, if they just make it so they turned a little bit faster, it would be so much easier to control them all. Um, but he is unbelievable. He is amazing. Look at this guy, dude. Super cool. And that's going to be it for today, ladies and gentle peeps. Thanks so much for coming to hang out with me. What did we do today? Some hot leveling up of our Reaper stuff. And we got a new basilisk, Jake the Snake. I hope that you had fun hanging out. I know that I did. Make sure if you liked the video, please don't forget. Show your support. Smash the thumbs up button. Feel free to share and favorite the videos you see fit. And may the stuff of things be with you.